Dan, these protesters were upset over what happened with Brenda Mendoza, and today they made that known. Where's the outrage? I'm outraged. Not one more murder at the hands of the police. These people are angry over the death of 20-year-old Brenda Mendoza, killed in a standoff with Salinas police on March 1st. A vigil, a call for change. This group is calling for justice, but more importantly, a better future for their children. I will stand and take a bullet for any child because I see all children as our seats. We need to invest in our youth and we need to invest in our future. While the DA investigates the shooting, police say it's too early to assign blame. What they haven't received are the facts of the case. So until we receive the facts of the case, I think we need to reserve judgment. We swear an oath to protect our community uh, from, from any threat. So as, as long as that is our job, we're going to continue, unfortunately, to face um, situations because humans, we are flawed. Mendoza's death is the second police shooting in Salinas so far this year. In California, there have been 29 such incidents. And across the country, 209 people have been shot and killed by law enforcement since the beginning of the year. And until those numbers change, these people say they will continue to fight back. And we asked Salinas police if the officers involved in this were back at work, but the chief says that she hasn't signed off on anything yet. Dan? Kyla, thank you. Action News has reached out to the district attorney as well, asking for a timeline of when they plan to release body cam footage. We have not heard back.